he may lose a little bit of muscle. So in other words, and that's called intermittent fasting. So eat one meal a day, and get all your calories in one meal. Your insulin's gonna spike once. Because the rest of the day you're drinking water and not eating at all. You're gonna burn a whole, gonna burn tons of fat. You don't want to fast and try to work out and stuff. after a certain amount of hours you've been done already used up all your calories to expend for energy food is for energy and you switch over to the fat after you back off on those meals you get down to one meal a day and fasting when I say one meal a day I don't mean one little small little meal a big ass meal that's gonna hold your ass. You big ass meal, that's gonna hold you. You're gonna burn fat. When you're doing shit like that, you can't be going on no 10 mile, eight and a half mile, seven mile walk to run ships. What you're gonna do is stay close to home. And you're gonna reserve your energy. And you're gonna stay close to home is what you're gonna do. A no food fast, you're gonna stay close to home. You're gonna drink water and piss all day. fight hunger body's gonna use up all the sugar that's in it and it's gonna start burning the fat don't start burning the fat as the primary source for energy Because you're going to burn either or. Just like me right now. I ain't got no sugar in me right now. There ain't no sugar in me right now. I'm burning fat right now. That's what I'm burning. I'm burning straight up fat. I could taste it in my mouth. I didn't did it enough times. I ate yesterday afternoon. So no, I didn't burn off all the sugar. It don't take long to burn off the sugar. It's like the first hour. You're gonna burn off like a, at my size. I'm burning off the sugar. The first hour. Whatever kind of sugar I have, from the bread, from fruit, from potato chips. Oh, you ate some pretzels after eight o'clock last night. I was hungry. So let me eat some pretzels.
And every morning, that's why when you go to bed with an empty stomach, you're gonna wake up with an empty stomach. Every morning I go out, I'm waking up with an empty stomach. Yeah, I'm going to cut back on these miles. For sure. Just like now, the way I feel. I can't wait to get in the house. And drink a cup, couple of cups of cold water. Take all this wet shit off. Put a towel in my seat. I always protect my furniture from sweat. And just sit my black ass down. And the nice and quiet and bring myself down. Whew. Oh boy. Yeah, I know it's gonna be a hot day today. But I see a lot of clouds cover over this valley I'm not so sure which way these clouds are moving because if they start moving west it's going to block out the sun that'll make for a cooler day well a less hot day how about that Yeah, I most definitely need some water, for sure. Y'all just hang with me there for another. Two minutes. I'm almost there. Yeah, they came and finally fixed that roof. So now I ain't got to anticipate when that rain comes. Because it's going to come. I'm going to get no real monsoons. Next month is the monsoon. Supposed to be the end of the monsoon season. But what I think is going to happen is it's just going to be a late monsoon season. I'm just glad that they fixed it. It was a small leak. It rained like hell a couple of weeks ago. Maybe a half a cup of water dripped out of this little place in the ceiling. I can't wait to get inside. Yeah, I can see where they fixed it, too. I can see where they doubled up the tile. And I can see the little uh, lumps and double up tile. And that's what it probably was, too. Because the way the tile sit, it shouldn't get... The 
where this tile sit, it shouldn't get wet the way they overlap. I'm home now. There goes my car again. See? I'm home once again. Getting the comfort of my own home. Peace, y'all.